on Saturday uh, with a lot of that rain happening very late Friday night and out of here by the time we start the day on Saturday. All of these storm pits just miraculously getting spookier as we get towards uh, Halloween. Look at this one. The nearly full moon got the clouds in there and that pine tree and just looks like a horror movie just about to happen out here. Uh, we got that in. Uh, from uh, Waterford Township. Uh, appreciate that shot on storm pins tonight. Uh, here's how things are going to shake up as we get towards the weekend. Again, most of tomorrow is at, at least the first part is going to be dry. We'll see some midday showers and then again, once we get to the eight o'clock hour, that's when we'll see that widespread rain start to move in and then the cold front finally sweeps through. Uh, once we head towards daybreak on Saturday morning, here's a little bit of good news. Drought monitor came out today and we're finally at least uh, done with the droughts across the state. We've got a few areas of those yellows and that's abnormally dry. That's the pre drought category. So uh, the drought is done and we're even going to make a dent in those dry areas as we head towards that rain on Friday going into Saturday. 51 tonight, few clouds around. It's milder night and here's your four zone forecast. These are the highs that we're expecting tomorrow and again, Soak it all in, even though we'll probably see some showers uh, at least during the midday hours. Temperatures getting into the low and maybe even mid 70s in some spots for highs tomorrow. South zone could be as warm as 73 in Lambertville. Blissfield, you'll be at 73 tomorrow. West zone, maybe some 60s up here in Livingston and Genesee County, but Ann Arbor and Canton, you're still going to hit the low 70s tomorrow. And our north zone, uh, you're bringing up the caboose here, but still mid 60s is what we're expecting for highs. And even though that's above average, most of this forecast is not. Once we get into Saturday through Thursday of next week, all of those temperatures in the mornings and in the afternoons below average for this time of year. So the weekend looking mostly dry Sunday, a slight chance of a north shower uh, in the morning, but I think a lot of us are going to stay dry. So it's just going to feel like fall uh, and even then.